Yeah, friends, it's India with Meena again and in continuation to the previous video which was about the backwater cruise in Kerala. Here we have, uh, this is a school and a church, the white and blue structure here. Okay, that's it, this entire, that, this blue one probably is associated with the same and this white and blue and this is the structure the whole thing is a school and there are school students coming out just see they're all let's go closer yeah so school students they've just finished school and they're leaving school there they are yeah. Yeah. so this is the school Patrick, what saint is this? Huh? No. Uh, K.E. Carmel Public School. That is the name of the school. That's it. And uh, there are children coming out of the school. Can you see the school? See. Matanti Catholici Kwa. See the children are going home on this boat. Can you see that? Wow. They're going home on the boat. And that is the church. That's the church. Okay. Oh, there's a bank also here. Uh, here. It's called Dhanalakshmi Bank. So, don't ever feel that these villages are uh, very, very uh, backward or they don't have anything. No, they're complete. They have schools, they have hospitals, they have a temple, they have banks, there are doctors, they have gardens. Uh, they have quite a life out here. No wonder that once these people got into, uh, you know, selling their art of Ayurvedic massage and uh, got into that field they don't want to leave home naturally with such a nice peaceful soothing life and so healthy can you see the amount of green that is here and plus very little pollution because they don't have cars they have these boats so the oxygen the air is pure and life is idyllic life is so soothing can you see that uh, that palm tree? That's a date palm. All these thin palms, they are date palms. Okay. Uh, yeah. Some of them are date palms and some of them are betel nut palms also. The ones who have the, the ones which have the thicker trunk, they have coconut. Now we are going under a bridge which goes from one bank of the backwaters to the other bank. So this is the bridge. And we are here. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> That's a fishing boat with one guy sleeping away and the other one. It's a motor boat. So they have put motors to their boats to make it easy for themselves. But yes, it has its own advantages and disadvantages. That's a temple. Can you see that? That's a temple. Let me bring it closer for you. Here. That's a temple. Okay. Yeah. Now here, the temples are unlike the ones in Tamil Nadu where they have a very good spire on top of them, which is called the Vimana and the one which is on top of the entrance is called the Gopura. But here they have the sloping roof uh, type of architecture. That's the local architecture. So the temples are not high up, they spread out. And they have these sloping roofs. That is the local architecture. See, that's another bridge because the backwaters branch out uh, into a turn 
so if you have to go from one end to the other end or one side to the other so you go on top of this bridge are patrick we, we are not going in there but there is a big houseboat going there oh so he says he is not going to go into the narrow canals because it's a problem the waters are very shallow and the houseboat can get stuck so we generally don't with these houseboats we don't go into the narrow canals if you want to go to the narrow canals then you have to take the small canoes small boats but because we are going to spend a, a night here so obviously it has to be a big houseboat and the big houseboats cannot go there here's another saint mary's high school oh this is like my school my school was also a saint mary's high school i am a product of saint mary's uh, saint mary's high school in bombay in bombay we have two saint mary's high school one is in santa cruz kalina that is on santa cruz east and the other one is uh, in town uh, near uh, kolaba so i was a student of saint mary's high school in santa cruz and here we have saint mary's high school okay so this is it Saint Mary's building. Uh, what is that? Blue, blue something something. Restaurant. So there are restaurants also. Okay. And so that is life on the house. Trip. Let me see what's there on the other side. Uh, we've been doing one side, and here I see. some activity something happening here what is this are these cool something something cool bar oh, oh that is a bar and here we have some parking space it's a no it's a depot kind of a thing yes it's a depot because the people waiting either for the boat or for the bus which is there from the other side and here we are super shop this is an older village yeah see that these houses are older houses still not reconstructed and then of course we have this nice new structure this is also a house actually right there those children have come back from school going back home wow here this is a house again nicely colored lots of blue houses i see blue seems to be a favorite color maybe blue is very cooling also because it gets very warm in the summers so probably that's why many of them paint their houses blue and you can see people with umbrellas already so the summer has set in people are walking out with umbrellas okay yeah children have just come back from school yeah and this is lower flower school okay holy family girls high school that's it holy family girls high school we have a holy family school in bombay also and we have a holy family school there also holy family girls high school there it is and uh, another thing that i would like to share with you is that there are lots of nuns and priests from kerala who have gone in many other countries they specifically they like to go to rome in italy but they go to other countries also i have had the opportunity to work with some groups which were brought in by some priests from here and the priest wanted to actually show them their his country his this uh, state his house so they had come for a tour of kerala and uh, i had a very good opportunity to work with them it's the members of the parish where the priest was 
uh, station or located. So some members of the parish said they wanted to see his village, they wanted to see his hometown, they wanted to see the state where he stays. So they had come here. Very interesting. Right? Yeah. There's a lot of Christianity here, yes. So once again, I stop now and shall connect with you later with some more information and some more sites. Bye.